Welcome to Grover Cleveland High School, home of the Cavaliers. You cows of 23 are the next generation, and you are the reason for this modernization. $150 million will be spent to build your state-of-the-art learning environment. By October, you'll be sinking pee balls through a rim we're sitting in new bleachers in our remodeled gym. By your senior year you'll notice, if you're keeping tabs, a brand new theater, a food court, and new science labs. Your Cleveland experience will see no reduction. We're still open for achievement during construction. Hi, my name is Damian Goodman. I'm one of the assistant principals here at Cleveland High School. I oversee the discipline policy here on campus. If students get into any kind of trouble, uh, I oversee the dean's office whose job it is to administer the district's um, discipline policy and the school's discipline policy. Okay, Mr. Wong. Um, like other schools, uh, obviously there are rules. The rules are in place to keep students safe. Um, one of the things that I believe in personally is that um, every student should have an incentive to try to do what's right. So even if a student does something and loses their privileges, we give them an opportunity to get those privileges back. But um, they have to show that um, they kind of buy into what we're trying to do here, which is provide a safe environment. Again, it's about safety. Um, and most of the times we even think about whether or not this is the right learning environment for them. One of the other things that I oversee here is the athletics program. Since uh, Cleveland is one of the largest schools in the district, we field over 44 teams. Um, we're very competitive in, in almost all of them. What we expect from our student athletes is that obviously they keep the GPA up, but that they demonstrate good citizenship um, and a commitment to the school. Cleveland has a very proud history when it comes to athletics. Anyone that's interested in um, playing sports for Cleveland High School should definitely talk to their counselor and uh, notify the athletic director so that he knows which sport you want to play and he can get all the information to you. All of the coaches information is on the website so if you're interested in tryout dates or uh, athletic paperwork please go to Cleveland's website under the athletics tab and all the information you need is there. Another thing that I'm responsible for here is the um, parking lot in some of the traffic situations. Um, we do not offer parking for students. We do ask that uh, parents not use the uh, parking lot to pick up and drop off their children. Um, Van Alden and Strathern, which are the streets that are pretty much in front of the school, get very, very crowded during the morning and the afternoon. So we do ask that you drive very safely, um, watch your speed, and watch out for students who may or may not use the crosswalks. Um, if you have any questions about anything I've brought up, uh, please feel free to contact me. Uh, my contact information is on the school website. Emailing me is probably the best way to get a hold of me. All in all, I'll be speaking to all of the students uh, uh, grade level by grade level. Thank you very much. Good morning. What's this? Uh, Epsom stone. 
You had in your pocket for a while, huh? Yeah, sorry about that. Okay, so today's May 10th, and um, it looks like you were absent way in February. Yeah. So um, you got to remember that we can't clear absences after it's been more than 10 days. Okay. You only have 10 days to turn in a note. We'll take it, we can put it in your file, but we cannot clear it in the system because it's been more than 10 days. Okay. Also, it looks like you were absent for nine days. Yeah. You can only be absent seven days all year. So, no more absences because you're already over the limit. Okay. All right? Okay. All right, Sorry have a good that. day. Yeah, you too. It's okay, have Thank a good you. day. Don't be like this guy. Absent for two days, okay. On the seventh and eighth, and today is the ninth. Perfect. So good. So you know the rule that you have to turn in your note within ten days. You only have two absences in the system. How many absences do you have? Only one. Yes. So perfect. So you only have three absences so far. Remember, you're only allowed seven a year, and you turned it in within the ten days. Perfect. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Okay. Be like this guy. I'm Lori Howe, Humanities Magnet Counselor, and my advice for freshmen is to follow the four P's. Be polite, prompt, prepared with a positive attitude, and you'll do fine at Cleveland High School. Hi, I'm Nissa Lotus. I'm the SAS Counselor here at Cleveland High School, and I'm also the Girls Varsity Basketball Coach. I'd say once you get here, get involved. Colleges want to see kids interactive, joining teams, joining the band, trying out for leadership. Do something, find it, and have a great time. Hi students, my name is Ms. Perez. I'm the counselor for the Global Media Studies Magnet and for the Media Arts Pathway here at Cleveland Charter High School. Uh, as you start high school, I just want to give you some advice. Uh, try to find an adult here on campus that you can trust and go to for anything that you need. That can be a counselor, a teacher, a coach, a social worker, anyone here that you find any adult um, that you can trust so you can go to them. Hi, my name is Diane Shapiro and one piece of advice I would give is to make sure you stay on top of your homework. Don't procrastinate. Make sure you do it every night. Take good notes and go over them in the evening before you go to bed because that's how you'll remember and get a lot of sleep. You need between eight and nine hours a night. Okay, welcome to Cleveland. Good morning class of 2023. My name is Sharon Drell and I'm the college counselor for 11th and 12th grade. It's not too early to start preparing for college. I would highly recommend that you all get involved in extracurricular activities, be it sports, clubs, or start your own club. Uh, the other thing is community service and making sure that you only get a C or better in any of your solid subjects. If you get lower than a C, four-year colleges will not accept a D. If you're temporarily located in C Hall, please come see us. Our door is always open. We have a lot of information in the college office. Hi, I'm Ms. Morales. I'm a counselor here at Cleveland. And a piece of advice I have for ninth graders is to make sure you stay organized. Use your agenda to write down important dates of projects and assignments you have in class. Organize your binder. Uh, make sure you have everything in a place where you can find it. Uh, don't procrastinate because it doesn't make it any easier when you wait till the last minute. Hi, my name is Mr. Sayed. I'm the psychiatric social worker. Excited for you all to join us here at Cleveland. Uh, just a word of advice. When you get here, you're going to feel nervous, you're going to feel anxious, and that's normal. All right, we'll see you around next school year. I'm honored to be your principal and look forward to an exciting four years filled with amazing academic programs and a variety of co-curricular and extracurricular activities to suit all interests and passions. Here at The Land, we ascribe to some key beliefs for our students to support their efforts to celebrate academic excellence, achieve personal success, and value social responsibility. Please know that I wish all of you much success and happiness. Parents and guardians, thank you for entrusting us with your children. Have a wonderful rest of your morning, and again, welcome to the Cleveland family.